If you want to see lesbian relationships that challenge societal norms and expand representation, you should definitely watch our selection for best of them. Number 10. If These Walls Could Talk To is a 2000 television film in the United States, broadcast on HBO. Presents three interwoven stories set in different decades, all exploring lesbian relationships within the same house. The film poignantly addresses themes of love, acceptance, and the evolving LGBTQ experience over time, creating a rich tapestry of emotions and connections. Number 9 Go to sleep. Close your eyes. The Killing of Sister George is a 1968 American film directed by Robert Aldrich. Examines the life of George, a beloved soap opera actress. As her career and personal life unravel, the film delves into the complexities of identity, power dynamics, and the blurred lines between fiction and reality. With a mix of dark humor and drama, it offers a provocative exploration of fame and authenticity. Down. Sit. Stay. Really, can't you see you're just torturing the poor child? Number 8. She's got a nice bone structure if you're into white girls. Do you think she is or isn't in the family? Tamara, why you always come? The Watermelon Woman is a 1996 American romantic comedy drama film written, directed, and edited by Cheryl Dooney. Chronicles Cheryl's journey to unveil the forgotten story of a black lesbian actress from the 1930s. This blend of fiction and reality navigates Cheryl's exploration of identity, history, and representation. The film engagingly captures her pursuit of truth while shedding light on underrepresented narratives, all within a compelling narrative that resonates with charm and thought-provoking depth. Do you think we should kids? You're a no good lying tramp, that's what you are. Committing a sin Number 7. My only clear memory is arriving. Desert Hearts is a 1985 American romantic drama film directed by Donna Deitch. Unfolds as Vivian, a professor, arrives in Nevada seeking a divorce. She meets Kay, a free-spirited sculptor, and their connection ignites a passionate, forbidden love. Against the backdrop of the 1950s, the film delves deep into Vivian's journey of self-discovery, exploring themes of courage, societal expectations, and the liberating force of love. As their relationship develops amidst the breathtaking desert landscape, Desert Hearts beautifully portrays the transformative power of embracing one's true identity and defying conventions. Eat your breakfast and leave the woman alone. It doesn't concern you, Francis. I can't claim angel's wings, but I am normal. Number 6 Amy and Jaguar is a 1999 German drama film set in Berlin during World War II. Portrays the intense love affair between Lily and Felice during World War II. Amidst the chaos, their forbidden connection thrives, revealing the strength of love in the face of adversity. The film explores the challenges of being true to oneself while navigating a world at war. Machen Sie ruhig weiter, noch ein Kuss. Nur einer, der letzte. Number 5 Dearest, there are no accidents. Carol is a 2015 romantic period drama film directed by Todd Haynes. Delves into the forbidden love between Therese and Carol, two women from different backgrounds in the 1950s. Their magnetic connection defies societal norms leading to a journey of self-discovery and heartache. 
The film captures the era's complexities while celebrating the enduring power of love. Would you? Number 4 It's gonna come along like it was made for you. Something that's gonna fit you like a glove. Bound is a 1996 American neo-noir crime thriller film written and directed by the Wachowskis, the movie centered on Corky and Violet's sizzling lesbian romance, which fuels their audacious plan to steal mob money. As their passion intensifies, so does the danger, blurring the lines between love and deception. With meticulous detail, the film weaves a tale of suspense and seduction, culminating in a high-stakes heist that challenges their loyalty and pushes their limits. They are bound. I think I'm a dead man. I'm one in the back of the head. For the pleasure. You were nothing before you met me. Violet! Number 3. Blue is the Warmest Color is a 2013 romantic drama film co-written, co-produced, and directed by Abdelatif Kachish, delves into the intense lesbian romance between Adele and Emma. It explores their journey of self-discovery, passion, and the challenges they face in a society that struggles to understand their love. The film captures raw emotions, portraying the highs and lows of their relationship with honesty and complexity. As Adele navigates her identity and desires, the film beautifully depicts the transformative power of love and its impact on one's sense of self. Number 2 Go back to Joe, Karen. It's too much for you this way. Stop talking about it. The Children's Hour is a 1961 American drama film directed by William Wyler. The story revolves around two women who run a girls' boarding school and face devastating consequences when a student spreads a false rumor about their relationship being romantic. Why, we've known each other since we were 17, and I always thought that... The Why are you saying all of this? Because I do love you. Before we unveil movie number one, here are a few honorable mentions. Directions. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Who help people like yourself. I'm Sinead. I like pain. I'm homosexual. I'm Graham, and I like girls a lot. I shouldn't even be here. You don't have any unnatural thoughts. Oh, I was thinking else already. Does she love you? But it doesn't matter. Oh, it's all that matters. You make me feel something I absolutely cannot feel. I can't. I know. He's my best friend. Have you told your mother about your honeymoon yet? You can run, but you can't hide. Hi, honey. I've made coffee. Mom? Oh. Primark Pictures invites you. But they didn't teach a business back then. Number one. Le portrait en bas, si le portrait lui plaît. L'a épuisé déjà un pas en travaillant vous. Que s'est-il passé? Portrait of a Lady on Fire is a 2019 French historical romantic drama film written and directed by Céline Sayama. The film is a romantic drama set in the late 18th century and follows the story of Marianne, a painter, and Heloise, a young woman she's been commissioned to paint. The two develop a deep connection as Marianne secretly paints Heloise, leading to a blossoming romance. Comment allez-vous vous marier? Je ne sais pas si je vais me marier. C'est parce que vous pouvez choisir. Que vous ne me comprenez pas. Je vous comprends. Do you agree with our list? Please let us know in the comments. And for more top 10 movie videos, be sure to subscribe to Movie Soul.